said back. And when I came in the Jedi events, I was really excited to come to high school. Yeah. It was quite dumb, but it actually got better as time went on. It was really big. <laughs> when I came, I wasn't really too scared because I did know some people and some people were in my class that I knew from primary school, but I still made any um, new friends. It was good because, well, I was quite scared because uh, there was new people and it was at my school and that. I think science, yeah, we both enjoy science very much. I don't know, it's just the experiments and, and the trying new, are yeah, a lot of fun. and trying out new things. We, it's very, yeah, we like it. Um, my favourite subject is French because I've learned how to speak French so then one day I can go to France and then I can speak to them. My favourite subject is music because it's the strongest area that I'm in. My favourite subject is English because I can really express myself, learn new things and it's always very nurturing environment. Drama. Um, I've learned that um, like confidence and like different types of speech and how to stay in character. My favourite subject is French because we learn different languages. My favourite subject is music because of the different varieties of instruments that we get to play and learn. So I have been in Kings Park Secondary since 2010, so this is my 8th year. I've been teaching at Kings Park for 11 years. I've been teaching in Kings Park since August last year. It's a really lovely school and I love working here. I have been teaching in Kings Park for 4 years. I've been here about 18 years now. Hey, I think I've been teaching here now nearly 5 years. Uh, nearly three years. I've worked at Kings Park just around four years. I've worked at Kings Park since the 23rd of October 2017, so about seven months. Nearly 29 years. I am a history teacher, so as part of that we do so many different topics. So we do early history, so we look at the Vikings and them coming to Scotland and the impact they had. We look at very kind of Scottish history as well, Wallace and Bruce and the Wars of Independence. So it's also talking about how he was kind of maybe watched Braveheart and how that's not really correct. I look after Aaron House and all the young people within that. Um, I work closely with Mrs Freighter just to ensure that all is well with the young people. Um, I am the ICT coordinator in Kings Park Secondary and also look after a few number of things throughout the school including tracking, monitoring and S2 and S3. We offer a wide variety of languages here at Kings Park. So for example, the young people do French, they can also pick Spanish. They have an opportunity to do master classes in German and also in Mandarin. And so I love teaching English. We get to teach loads and loads of different things. We get to read novels, we get to read plays, we get to watch films, we get to do loads of different writing. Um, it's fantastic. A practical subject and we teach wood skills, metal skills, we also teach graphic skills. All the really cool stuff, so lots of coding, um, we'll show you how to do websites, uh, we learn about making programs and computer games, um, lots and lots of really interesting stuff. So for our MPS it's really good because we get to do religion and moral issues that's really relevant to young people like euthanasia, abortion, and we also get to look at philosophy as well, which is things like the origins of the universe and whether God exists. So there's loads and loads of different things that we cover. At the moment, we're just kind of working through the coursework, doing different activities. So things like mind maps, you've got targes, other kind of puzzles, eh, and helping them kind of work on the problems in schools. So far, I'm in charge of S5 and S6. Uh, I organise all the, the enrolments for S5 and S6. I organise parts of their curriculum, we got involved in their graduation ceremony and all these sorts of things as well. I'm also in charge of Lewis House, so any people from Lewis House who um, need help and support, I'm there for them as well. I like teaching the programming side of it, I think that's interesting and you can put a lot of activities into the programming side of it, so you can get lots of puzzles and lots of computational thinking. 
As a deputy, I'm very lucky because I do lots of different things. So one of the things I do is work very closely with pastoral care and pupil support. So I get to know lots of different young people. I'm also head of Mull House, so I get to know all the young people in Mull House much more than the others as well. And I also look after learning and teaching. So I get to work with lots of teachers on that, but also to try and improve all the chances for the young people. In Model Studies, uh, we teach about society, I suppose. We teach about things that are changing and things that are happening around the world. Um, in politics, uh, we teach about how the political system in Britain works. We teach about politics in America. Um, in people in society, we teach about what it's like to be a young citizen. And we talk about the history of the West of Scotland and the history of Glasgow. Yep, we have been on quite a few trips. We go kind of trips within Glasgow. So every year we do a Holocaust Memorial uh, education visit within Glasgow. So that's good. S2 uh, pupils go on that trip. It's about, usually about 40 S2 pupils. Um, in the past, we have uh, ran uh, trips to Belgium for the World War One battlefields, which has been fantastic. So we've had over 30 um, kind of S3 pupils out to Belgium and France. And it's exciting because you get to go to the places that they've been learning about. So they're standing where the soldiers stood and that's really exciting. I enjoy all the clubs. I've helped out all the clubs, football, basketball, athletics, volleyball, badminton, fitness. Fitness in the, the school has been really, really popular. Um, getting new equipment like this helps. So this is the, the squat rack and bench rack. It's been really, really popular. We've had as many as 20 pupils come down at lunchtime or after school. We want to get it busier, we want to get more people active. That's my job. Um, two after school clubs. I do a school show, um, and that's going to be a little couple of hours this year. And on Wednesdays, there's an orchestra, which I play the violin and play two at the moment. So it's challenging, but not too much. Can I get to We've got lots of clubs going, there's an orchestra. There's fiddle group, there's a school show, there's choirs, there's a, a ukulele club, um, there's loads of clubs, loads of activities. But sometimes I go to the art club. Yeah, same here. I would like to join more clubs, so I think in the new year, um, well, once we get into S2, I might join up new clubs. Mm -hmm. We do like gym classes most nights. We enjoy doing a guitar club. Like the English department, we offer loads of different things. We do lots of trips out to the cinema and the theatre and to different places. I took my second years to Edinburgh Dungeons last year because we were studying a book to do with working here. We have a variety of clubs. We have a writing club, we have an anime club. So different things that you can come to at lunchtime. Skills that I've learned is social interactions and how to work together to create a music piece. So, yeah. We worked how to work well with other people and have the confidence to like show share our ideas with other people. We did a lot of group work and communication skills um, and we did lots of like short talks and different subjects to work on our confidence. So like never doubt yourself when you're in classes to like always be positive and know that you can like work. And first year with learn how to build things and how to work with other people and how to play different things and draw different things. It's been really fun. I've learned listening skills and I've learned uh, writing skills, literacy skills. Yes, too. Sometimes we go down to the library, go on the computers to um, go on Sundog to improve uh, math skills. So in S2, you get to learn how to do computer pro programming by using Scratch and Filmmaker. And you get to learn how to use good conversation skills in drama. So I'd say that we um, do a lot of team working, team working, team building exercises. So um, in like a variety of classes, we often have to work in groups. Sometimes making our own groups. Sometimes working with people we wouldn't usually work. In music, we make films using the iPads, um, and we all have to work in groups and things like that. So our teamwork skills are really improved.